I can't believe it's 2022. The years really do start coming and they don't stop coming. <laughs> anyway, welcome back to the video. Did you like my new intro? I'm so proud of how it came out. Let me know in the comments what you think. I figure it does go by kind of quickly, but each time you watch a new video, you can focus on a different aspect of it maybe. Um, but yeah, I definitely like how it turned out. Um, today's video is just going to be about my 2022 goals, my resolutions, if you will, because of course it's that time of the year and I like making goals, even though I feel like I never really follow through with some of them, but this year I'm going to, but I say that every year. So, I mean, we'll see how this goes. Um, yeah, so I have some goals that are related to YouTube and kind of my business on here and then on just some personal goals and such as well. So I hope you like the video. Go ahead and actually like the video and also subscribe if you want to. Normally my videos are about travel, travel tips, photography, that kind of thing. So if you're into that, help a girl out. I'm trying to get to uh, 1k subscribers, which I'll talk about um, with my goals. So here we go. YouTube goals. First of all, I definitely want to try revamping my videos a little bit as you saw like with the new intro and stuff like that. I really, I want to try out some new stuff, new editing techniques, new filming techniques, you know, doing different like transitions, all sorts of stuff like that. Um, just to make my videos maybe a little more professional looking. I did get a new light. Um, I talked about that in a couple videos ago, but I did get some soft boxes, so I will have a better light in my videos. And then also just, you know, different kind of techniques and stuff to make my videos just stand out better, hopefully, and keep viewers more engaged and actually watching longer because I also need watch hours. Um, yeah, because I want to get monetized and to get monetized, you need two things two main things at least. Um, you need a thousand subscribers and you need 4,000 watch hours. So yeah, <laughs> trying to, trying to get there. Um, if you like my videos, please subscribe, share them so I can, you know, get my videos more out there. I've been sharing my videos like crazy and up talking them on all my social media platforms. But of course, it's just hard to get people to actually subscribe. If you have a Google account, you can subscribe. It's really easy. Okay, but I don't want to seem too desperate, I guess. So moving on to my more personal goals. And these are hopefully going to be more fun than slaving over the computer, trying to get my videos to get watches and subscribers. <laughs> Okay, so first of all, I want to eat healthy, which like I said, this is one I always say every year and I always kind of fall back and stop eating as healthy. I really don't eat that unhealthy. Um, I mean, I live with my parents. My mom really likes cooking and healthy living and stuff. So a lot of what I eat is pretty healthy, but I do have snacking issues, I guess you could say. Um, and then I also want to exercise more. That is a little hard. I live a very sentient life working on the computer most days. I don't really leave the house that often. Um, and especially now that it's winter and it's super cold outside, I'm not able to, you know, go outside and do stuff to get exercise. But I am going to try to do more like workouts inside, like on the TV and stuff. So we will see how that goes. I really want to try to lose maybe 20 pounds. I definitely used to be skinnier back in the day. Um, but we're not going to get into my body um, image issues. Um, and so we're going to talk about social media, which probably ties into my body image issues. But you know, it's whatever, I guess. Um, I want to post more photos on social media. I am a photographer and I feel like I always have all these photos that I want to share and then I never do, or at least not on a regular basis, but I really want to try posting photos 
more like daily. <laughs> I have a photography Facebook page and a photography Instagram. You can find the links below um, in the description. So I want to try posting there more often. And there's also some other like random photo websites. Maybe I'll start posting on more as well just to, you know, get my photos out there. And again, always link it up to the YouTube thing. Um, along with the whole photography thing is I also want to start taking more artsy photos. I kind of talked about this um, in a different video, but back in the day, I used to take a lot more like self portraits and like conceptual photos, you know, with like deep meaning and stuff like that, or just like artsy nature photos or anything like that. Now I feel like most of the photos I take are either of my chickens <laughs> or our travel photos and I just want to be able to take more photos that I feel like really proud of that are more planned out photo shoots rather than just spur of the moment you know snapshots you know um, I also want to take more film photos I do shoot sometimes 35 millimeter film and I just want to do that more um, I have this weird disconnect between like digital and film where I feel like film is more important and the photos need to be more, you know, just like better <laughs> because obviously you can only take the one photo. Um, but I don't know, but I feel like film is more of a memory keeper, if that makes sense. I don't know. Um, yeah, let me know if you want more videos about like film or shooting film. That might be something that I might be into doing <laughs> if if you would uh, watch those videos and subscribe. <laughs> anyway, um, I also want to just do more art in general. I used to paint a lot and now I haven't painted in forever. I want to make more designs and stuff for my Redbubble shop and kind of revamp that because that is a, you know, a little bit of an income stream for me. So I want to make that a little bit better. Um, and I also want to work on my novel <laughs> that I started and I, the last book I wrote was in like 2018 and then I never ended up revising it or anything. But yeah, so I've kind of started working on a new one. It's like told in poetry instead of like standard um, prose, but we'll see how that goes if I finish it or anything. That's it that I have on my little list here. Um, let me know in the comments your own goals for 2022, whether they're YouTube goals or art goals, health goals, whatever. Let me know. Um, I will hopefully stay accountable on my end. I mean, I've been pretty good about eating healthy so far this year, but I haven't really worked out <laughs> or done anything else on my list pretty much but well I did make the new intro for my uh videos so and there's gonna be a new outro too so I guess here's that okay thanks for watching I hope you have an awesome day sorry I'm always a little bit on the rambly side bye